when the Lord was showing this to me, I was privileged to be ministering in, um, in Canada uh, and um, the home of the, the, these, uh, this couple at, the, at about a hundred yards away from their property was an eagle's nest. And every year this uh, breeding e couple would come to, uh, uh, to raise their eaglets. And they had on their, on their back deck, you know, like a telescope that was just focused on the nest. So you could see, you know, we were there for this particular season where these eaglets were just beginning to kind of emerge. And, these, you know, when an eagle, eaglet is born, it's like all beak and the body kind of grows onto the beak, you know. Because what I saw is this massive beak and like nothing else. You know, and as we were there over that season, and she explained this to us, the couple who lived there, that as the eaglets grow, their wings start to get really big, too big for the nest. And then there comes the season of fledgling, fledging, where the mother and father eagle will, will, will literally fly above the nest and, and screeching, because these North American bald eagles have a very high voice, they screech at their young, you know, spread your wings and catch that wind, catch fear, because they're, those little eaglets are thinking, yeah, you could do it, I can't. I ain't leaving. You know, when's salmon coming, Mom? Hungry. And, you know, every other day around this time, you were bringing food. Let's get on with the show here. We're both, me and Junior here, we're hungry. And Mama's about to start to say to them, kids, that, that, that day is over. Dad and I are not going to feed you anymore. It's time for you to spread your wings. I don't think so, Mom. You know, I don't think my wings work. You know, they're, they're kind of here, and I'm not sure if they actually do work, and I don't trust them. You know, you guys can fly. Me and Junior here. We're looking at each other like, when's the salmon coming, Mom? <laughs> you know, and the mom will flap, flap her wings and screech, spread your wings, because once she knows that once the wings go out and they catch a little bit of air, as they jump, they jump, you know, a foot, or 18 inches, you know, or maybe a meter, and then they go, oh no, thank you very much. I'm going to another church. Hallelujah. <laughs> now, that mother eagle saying, this is the time for you to get out of the nest, Junior. So she will put her big beak into that nest and start ripping it apart. All that soft cushy down is being ripped out. And all the hard, you know, thorns and thistles and stuff that she purposely built for this moment. You know, Mom, that's uncomfortable. Will you stop that? Get Daddy over here. I want to have a talk with him about you. I don't know what's got into you. What are you doing taking the nest apart? 